The number of children in London is dropping and threatening the future of the capital's schools. Stark new data by London councils, which represents every London borough, says almost 8,000 fewer children will need school places over the next four years. They said the drop in demand for school places is down to multiple factors, mainly a falling birth rate, but families leaving London due to Brexit, the pandemic, the cost of living crisis and a lack of affordable housing. Their report says schools will be forced to close down because of this. Others that remain open could see their educational standards dropping as they try to balance their budgets by narrowing their curriculum or cutting things like after school clubs and even teachers. This is because schools are funded according to the number of pupils they have. So if classes aren't full, they lose out on money. London schools have dramatically improved over the past 20 years, but there are now fears that this could set back these achievements. Ian Edwards from London Councils says much work is going on to ensure schools thrive despite this difficult climate. The figures projected by London Councils forecast a 4.4% drop in demand for reception places, which is the equivalent of 3,864 places or 128 classes. Schools across London have already started to close or merge in a bid to survive. Vauxhall MP Florence Eshalomi is campaigning on this issue and said London risks becoming a soulless place if the number of children here continues to drop. London Councils is calling for the government to ensure school funding keeps up with inflation to help schools cope with the changing levels of demand for places. It also wants more powers for local authorities to work with academies, which currently are not under their control, despite local authorities being responsible for managing school places. The Department for Education told us it's for local authorities and academy trusts to balance the supply and demand of school places in line with changing demographics, as they have done for many years. Now London's birth rate has historically ebbed and flowed and London is likely to become a more popular place to raise a family at some point in the future. London Council says it is therefore vital that empty school buildings are not sold off but instead kept for educational purposes so there is flexibility for the future.